Hello everyone, welcome to my simulated classroom. Today we are starting a new playlist on RF circuit simulation using Serenade, a free simple software yet capable of doing some amazing work. Yeah, it's a very old software. Uh, it's actually uh, expired on 2005 already, but for uh, uh, beginner for educational purpose I think uh, it's a good software very good software okay so let's start the software after uh, starting the software uh, okay you just cut it uh, you go to file new project click ok okay give any name let's uh, for us it should be uh, first one you can give any name no issue yes okay so here is your schematic window okay so in schematic window you can do any uh, simulation like if you want to do uh, passive simulation like uh, you want to do some uh, rc rc filter uh, circuit then you can do you can bring uh, uh, your register we have capacitor we have inductor so we can do passive simulation also we can do active simulation also because you can see here we have active devices okay and if you uh, know something about s2p file like uh, uh, s parameter files and you have that s parameter file then you can also uh, do your simulation for active device uh, if you have any uh, data sheet data sheet for that active device okay but for now uh, as it is the first video of this software so we won't go so deep about uh, those things simply we will uh, try to simulate one mi micro strip line okay try to uh, simulate one micro strip line uh, which will have z0 as 50 ohm z0 means character stick impedance okay so we will uh, we'll try to simulate it here so uh, for micro strip line the most important thing is the substrate information which substrate you are using so first of all we will try to simulate a substrate for simulate a substrate you need to go here okay you can see my mouse uh, you need to go to transmission line click this is your uh, substrate making window okay so as it is a micro strip line so here is our conductor part this is our substrate we have many other option also like if you want to design for strip line see this is strip line conductor is between uh, the dielectric but uh, for now we will concentrate on micro strip line so you can see we have two part this is the left you can put the dimension of your conductor and here you can put the electrical information of your conductor okay so what we will do here we will simply try to prove one thing as you know we already know that if your micro strip line is of 50 ohm and you terminate it with a 50 ohm register then there should be zero reflection from the termination end and zero reflection in s parameter term mean s11 should be zero in magnitude it should be zero and in dv it should be minus infinity but in simulation we can't get minus infinity so we'll get something very large minus value like minus 30 minus 70 or minus 150 or 160 okay we should be getting it then uh, we can prove that yeah our software is running well okay so we'll try to simulate a uh, micro strip line with 50 ohm uh, characteristic impedance and electrical length okay we'll we'll come to what is electrical length okay so if you have this electrical information like electrical length z naught then we, we will fill it up here like we have the information it is 50 ohm Oh, impedance uh, unit is already ohm so we not, don't need to specify here electrical length uh, what is electrical length uh, we know e equal to beta l and beta is your 2 pi by lambda and l okay and l should be in terms of lambda okay the signal you are using you can find it it's lambda from the frequency and the velocity of that signal okay so for now let's consider lambda uh, our l equal to 1 lambda so we will have electrical length as 2 pi and you can see uh, in electrical uh, length your dimension is given this unit is given in degree okay so 2 pi in degree it is 360 put it here 
okay so uh, we need to specify frequency also what is the frequency so we'll uh, simulate this for 3 gigahertz and uh, we already uh, have the unit as gigahertz so don't need to specify here okay so this is the right part but what about left part see if you have the information of right part then you can click synthesize and you will get the information for your left side okay and if you have the information of your left side like what is the w width of the of your substrate what is the physical length mean, means in millimeter or in meter what is the physical length and if you have those information then you put it here and click analyze and you will get the electrical parameter derived from that okay so we can start from both the way knowing the electrical parameter then start from here and if you know the dimensional means uh, physical parameter then you can start from left side okay. and frequency is common you can write it three here automatically it will be fitted here three only no issue similarly for three gigahertz okay now i am clicking synthesis and you just keep your your eye on this portion what happen after i click synthesize so when i am clicking synthesize oh sorry sorry take me pardon uh, we need to uh, fill these two things also because uh, synthesizing this from electrical length to dimension or from dimension to electrical length we need to have the information of substrate what is the height and what is the epsilon r these two must be there other thing like 10 delta and those things are optional so for our this experiment uh, let's height be 2 millimeter already dimension is in millimeter given epsilon let it be 2.2 okay so now we can synthesize so after i click synthesize this two box should be get filled up so click synthesize and see we, we have getting a width of 6.18 millimeter and physical length as 72 millimeter so here we have uh, simulated the microstrip line and the substrate we, uh, we have so we need to export those things to our schematic window so for uh, exporting your transmission line click here and get it here this is our transmission line and we also provide the substrate information to our schematic window so click here and here is our substrate okay now what we will do we will bring a register we will click R on our keyboard so it will rotate we will put it here will give the value so it is 50 ohm so it's a 50 ohm register now bring the wire this is our wire click here click so this wire is connected okay we need a ground so bring the ground here ground and to give the signal from this side we'll provide the RF signal of 3 gigahertz so give the signal we need to have a port and this is your microwave port bring it here okay and uh, port have the reference impedance so here by default it is 50 you can give anything but for now we'll keep it 50 only to show that our reflection coefficient is uh, 0 here because ref uh, reference is 50 transmission line is 50 your register is 50 then only you will get s1 of 0 so for now it is 50 only click ok again bring the wire right click sorry sorry left click left click and right click then your wire will be connected so circuit part is done this is substrate information so substrate information don't need to be electrically connected to this uh, the circuits this is just to inform our uh, simulator that our h is 2 millimeter and epsilon is 2.2 so don't worry about like why it is not connected uh, with this circuit so last part left is to bringing a signal generator because 3 gigahertz need to be given to this port but from where the 3 gigahertz will come so uh, this is our signal generator uh, you see uh, we are giving a signal from 1 gigahertz to 5 gigahertz with the step of 200 megahertz you can change it also so if you make it smaller then your curve will be more, more smoother curve so for us let it be 20 megahertz click ok so i hope everything is done now we need to analyze it okay so here click analyze analyze or by short you can f10 also you can click so we'll click analyze and it will analyze the circuit okay if any, any error will come you'll get the pop-up so hopefully you have we are not getting any error then click on report report editor so we'll see s11 in db format edit 
এইভাবে দিতে হয় নাও বিফোর ক্লিকিং ডিসপ্লে হোয়াট ডিসপ্লে উই আর এক্সপেক্টিং অ্যাকচুয়ালি সো আওয়ার এস ওয়ান ওয়ান শুড বি মাইনাস লার্জ নাম্বার মাইনাস সিক্সটি মাইনাস সেভেন্টি অ্যাট থ্রি গিগাহার্স ফ্রিকুয়েন্সি দেন আওয়ার সার্কিট সিমুলেশন ইজ কারেক্ট ওর আওয়ার দিস সফটওয়্যার ইজ ওয়ার্কিং কারেক্টলি ডিসপ্লে এন সি হোয়াট ইউ আর গেটিং এট থ্রি গিগাহার্স ইউ আর গেটিং মোর দেন মাইনাস ওয়ান ফিফটি ফাইভ এট থ্রি গিগাহার্স সো দ্যাট মিন্স উই হ্যাভ সিমুলেটেড ইট কারেক্টলি আফটার দ্যাট ইফ ইউ ফেব্রিকেট দিস ইউ ওন গেট সো মাচ অফ এক্ুরেট রেজাল্ট ইন ফেব্রিকেশন ওর ইন রিয়েল ওয়ার্ল্ড গেটিং মাইনাস টেন ডিবি ইজ ভেরি গুড like will if you getting anything result minus 10 db then it's well good but okay but in simulation we are getting minus 150 or something it's i have put the drive link in description to get this software so thanks a lot for watching i am waiting in comment section for any query